hey there good people welcome back to our channel today i am back with another simple video and today's video is all about an update or a progress from our previous video upload on uh, the zucchinis and the cucumbers i want to make some hanging post or attachment for my cucumbers and i just want to show you how i do that by myself kindly do remember to subscribe to like to comment and invite your friends to watch the video as we grow this channel and let's do this <laughs> now this is a very simple video and i think a straight a forward one what i'm going to make is something that is temporarily something that is uh, simple with the uh, available materials that i can find around and uh, that is because um, the place where i have planted the cucumbers it is not a permanent place they will be moving the next season i will move them f uh, to another place so i need something that is temporarily something that after this season is over i'm going to move it to another place where i will plant the cucumber so i got these uh, branches these are three uh, branches i got them from around the compound and so this means that you can find something around you that uh, can work like this and so what i'm going to do is just uh pin them to the ground as you see me doing and so as i have said this video is very straightforward you're going to see what i'm going to do i have a scissors i have a thread and so i'm going to use a, a thread just to tie the the branches and i'll make uh, some uh, like something like a, a symbol fence and uh, i also use this uh, thread to tie the cucumbers and to these are uh, a small post of mine so that they can attach themselves there and uh, this is something that i love doing i love attending to my garden and uh, i love doing this work and uh, the reason why i'm i'm even doing this video is just to encourage you because i know there are so many people who have uh, tried to plant cucumbers and because they lie on the ground they get uh, uh, they get destroyed by the insect they get uh, they start rotting because uh, the wetness of the ground and all that they don't do well and so this is just to show you there is another way for you to plant your cucumbers there is another way for you to make them still remain fresh and uh, healthy without uh, a touch of uh, rottenness or bites from the in insect or some of those small animals in the ground so we are going to use the thread so just being keen on the video because uh, i may not be able to explain everything so this is what i'm doing and i hope you can see and i apply the same these cucumbers are very promising as you can see they are already producing and the reason why i'm doing this uh, really fast so so that uh, they don't get uh, destroyed on the ground it is uh, raining there's a lot of rains and so i have to do this even though i'm late <laughs> yeah better late than never so they are promising they look very healthy and they are pure organic we have been trying to uh, apply some organic measures to make sure that uh, we get fresh and healthy cucumbers something that we can just munch on them fresh as they are we can make salads without any worry if they are going to harm us or uh, not and so you see what i'm doing it is just simple as uh, this
I am done making my small hanging for my cucumbers and the last thing I'm going to do now is do some uh, pruning that is uh, removing the lower leaves of the cucumbers. The reason is that um, this is to encourage airflow and also um, to let the cucumbers be exposed to sunshine. That is to help uh, the plant get full sunshine, especially for the fruits. And also this is just to tell the plant that uh, now it is time to direct all it is energy into fruit formation and not just supporting the leaves, that is the foliage. And also the much of overlapping of the leaves may encourage the powdery mildew disease which we do not want at this stage so it is always advisable that you prune some of the leaves and um, the the plant will always do good and so i have done this and uh, i'm expecting some good result This is uh, one week after I put up this, <laughs> my simple structure to hold my cucumbers. And uh, this is just to show you how they are attaching themselves so well. You can see, see this one? Yeah, so they are finding their way just around and they are trying to attach themselves and uh, the fruits are also coming up this one is is almost ready we have others on this other side yeah so what I wanted is the fruits to hang the cucumbers to hang like this not to touch the ground because sometimes when they touch the ground they start uh, rotting especially because the soil is wet it is raining so when they are hanging like this they don't uh, get destroyed uh, so much so I just uh, I just wanted to give you an update and uh, I think this is it so we are still uh, looking forward to a lot of uh, cucumber fruits there's so many that are coming up so in the next few weeks we will have a lot of uh, cucumbers for the juices for smoothies eating raw and uh, so on and as you can see the plant is healthy I have just sprayed some uh, milk this morning I don't know if you can see on this leaf. Yes, I've sprayed some milk, and uh, I will do a video on that tomorrow just to show you or to tell you why I am spraying the milk to the cucumber and even the other squash, like the zucchini and the pumpkins. So, I hope you enjoy this, and I hope this continues to motivate you. Thank you, and uh, Welcome to my channel once more.